Welcome to Quick Tips by Wetham Solutions. Today we're going to show you how to delete your browser cache using Mozilla Firefox. So in order to do this, open up Mozilla Firefox and what you can do is go to the Tools menu at the top here. Now first before we do this, if you don't see the Tools menu, uh, you may see nothing such as like is displayed right here. And if you need to be able to view the uh, menu option, just hold down the Alt button and press F at the same time. It'll bring up your file menu and it'll do that for any program that you're in that has a file menu. And once you've done that, just go over to View, Toolbars, and then Menu Bar. This will ensure that the menu bar does show up and you can then, of course, uh, go to the Tools bar anytime you'd like to. So what we're going to do is go to Tools and then we're going to go down to Clear Recent History. Click on that, and what it'll do is bring up a new prompt here uh, that will give you an option as to what you'd like to clear. Uh, first of all, it's going to give you time range. What would you like to clear? Everything that's in the uh, the whole browser history, or anything within the last hour, four hours, anything today. Um, so uh, if you're going to clear your browser cache in order to download fresh content, best option is just click on everything, uh, and then down here it'll show you uh, what you want to what you what you, what options you have as far as deleting. So I'm going to click the uh, the up arrow here because m many of you will only see this initially and if you'd like you can click on the down arrow and then it'll show you the uh, the details of what you're about to delete so first of all browsing and download history uh, form and search history cookies cache active logins and site preferences most of these are pretty self-explanatory uh, browsing and download history this is going to be the most uh, uh, this is going to be the thing that you not not necessarily need to delete in order to to update you know things such as flash files uh, images image hoverovers things like that so if you're downloading old content it's not necessarily this but if you do have a problem after deleting uh, and you don't have this checked off, then you can try it again with it checked off. I'm going to leave it unchecked for the for this demonstration. Form and search history. I don't really necessarily want to delete that because uh, that's not really going to stop old content from being uh, downloaded uh, or new content from being downloaded in in place of the old content. I should say. Uh, cookies, same thing. This is just to store you know things such as my sessions when I log in with a username and password. So I'm going to leave that unchecked as well. Cache is the one that you definitely want to leave checked off because that is where it stores all of the old content and doesn't update it with fresh content. So we're going to go ahead and uh, leave that checked off. Active logins, we don't want to delete that. Site preferences, we don't want to delete that either. So I'm going to go ahead and just uh, leave everything unchecked except cache. Click clear now and everything is going to have uh, is going to be clear. So now anything that I view uh, from any websites that I visit, it's always going to be fresh content rather than downloading the old content uh, that the computer is storing already.